Welcome to 5 Minutes of Sustainability. We're part of the Irish Schools Sustainability Network and we are here to answer the question, what can I do about climate and biodiversity loss? Climate change and biodiversity loss are connected. Let us explain. Burning fossil fuels, such as coal, gas and oil, releases a gas called carbon dioxide. Carbon dioxide traps heat in our atmosphere and this has caused our world to become warmer. Carbon dioxide acts like a blanket over the world, keeping us warm. As we put more and more fossil fuels up into the atmosphere, the blanket becomes thicker and thicker and warmer and warmer. The word diversity means variety. Difference. When we talk about biodiversity, we're talking about the variety of life on this planet. We are talking about nature. All of the different plants, mammals, birds, fish, insects, even all the different types of microorganisms. You may know that biodiversity is in trouble. In the last 50 years, the amount of wildlife increased by 69%. Scientists say that we are at the start of a sixth mass extinction, but should we care? Well, we depend on biodiversity for clean air, food and for water. Biodiversity also helps to slow down climate change. So how is the biodiversity crisis and the climate crisis linked? Let's look at just one example. Throughout 2022, forest fires forced tens of thousands of people to evacuate their homes. If we look just at the EU, by November of 2022, over 2 million acres of land had been burned due to forest fires. That's the same area as County Cork and County Dublin combined. Forest fires release carbon dioxide into our atmosphere, which makes our climate change problem worse. So let's talk about why trees are amazing for helping to stop climate change. Well, they take carbon dioxide out of the atmosphere. They then store this carbon dioxide in their roots, in their trunk, and in their branches. The amount of carbon dioxide a tree can absorb in its lifetime depends on size, species, and location. Over a lifespan of around 100 years, one tree can absorb one ton of CO2. That's equal to the emissions released from driving a diesel car for 6,000 kilometers. That is 18 return trips from Waterford to Dublin. But, but trees do more than just slow down climate change. They also reduce flooding and planting the right trees can help to cool down our local environment. Trees also support biodiversity. They create a home and food for wildlife. This is an oak tree. One of these can support an amazing 2,300 wildlife species. Their acorns are food for badgers, squirrels, mice and jays. Their leaves are eaten by caterpillars and other insects. The bark is home to many different lichen and fungi and is also a great place for birds and bats to build their nests. But not all trees are equal. In Ireland, we have lots of plantations of Sitka spruce. These are non-native plantations and very little wildlife grows in them. About 10% of Ireland is covered in these plantations. Native woodlands, on the other hand, are also biodiverse. They are full of life, but only 1-2% to 2 of Ireland is covered in native woodlands. So, we need to plant more native trees. You can still help even if you don't own any land. You can start by planting trees in your garden at home. Plant trees around your school or in a space in your neighborhood. There are lots of native trees that are suitable for small gardens, like the rowan, the birch, and the crab apple. You might think that planting one tree isn't going to make a real difference. We did a plant to plant campaign last year in our schools. There were five schools involved and we planted over 1,200 trees in our own back gardens at home. Let's spark social change. Let's reimagine our own garden spaces to be wildlife havens. It's good for our well-being too. Scientists have evidence that even looking at a tree reduces both our blood pressure and our stress levels. Take a minute now to discuss how you are going to take action as an individual, as a class, or as a school. It's important to make a plan so that we actually take action rather than just talk about it. We hope you are watching these videos as a whole school. Let's change some mindsets. Watch out for our next video. See you soon.